And welcome back to another episode of Real People, Real Life, right here in Wichita, Kansas. America! America. But right America. here on West 13th. <laughs> At Cloud 9 out here on West 13th. Or it is West 13th, but it's real close to... Riverside. It is the Riverside area. It is the Riverside area. Mm-hmm. I love this little here. area, yeah. you got a nice location, don't you? I know, I like it. I like it a lot better than my location. I know, I do too, I do too. So what all goes on here at Cloud 9? You got a lot that goes on here. Oh, we do a lot. Um, the front area is considered Love and Co. Um, so I started with my mother. Love and Co. Um, yeah, Love and Co. Sorry about that. Um, we do a lot of hand making, candles, lotions, soaps, sprays, wax melts. Um, we import uh, Shea from Ghana. We pretty much do a lot of a lot of bath and body stuff. Right. And you were just using some of that shade. I you? was, but you know, not just on my skin, but in my hair. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's great for everything. It's a, it repairs skin. A lot of women use it for stretch marks. Some people use it for the hair mm-hmm. and their feet. Hands. It repairs skin. Uh, scars. Really? Like I burn my finger really bad and it's kind of back to normal already. But just only using shade, so it helps Seriously? A lot. Yeah. Because I recently like got a chemical burn from using product that had had it was bad, mm-hmm. and I've been using coconut oil. But you think that shea would work real good? Shea mixed with coconut oil and some vitamin E. That would do it, wouldn't it? Yeah. Lot, yeah. That's not a bad idea. Okay, so if somebody wants to get the shea from you, what? Tell me, what are we looking at here? Look at that. Eight ounce cans. Okay. Um, these are raw. No additives, no process, nothing. So, looks like Oh, uh, yeah. How much would those go for? These are $9. That's not bad. Not bad. But it lasts a long, long time. You go a long way. You only need a little bit. And then we have some textures here. And what's mm-hmm. the other one? What's the yellow one? The yellow one is going to be the more, there's going to be the actual unprocessed raw. So, it still has a, has a lot more minerals, has a lot more of the good stuff in it. So really? the white one has been processed a little bit, just cleaned basically. So it ah. takes a little bit of the color and a little bit of the minerals out of it. So yeah. How much is the yellow in a tin? Nine also. Nine, nine also? Yeah. Wow, that's pretty cool. Okay, Love & Co. Candles. Mm-hmm. That's a very uh, cool art that your mom taught you, surely? Yeah, uh, my mom, she, she started doing it for like a therapy, yeah. like making candles and uh, I had a smoke shop and I needed like uh, incense and candles and stuff. So I was about to make a wholesale order for uh, some uh, incense and some candles. And in my head, I remember my mom used to make these candles in the back room. Right. So um, I was like, Mom, we need to make those candles. She's like, oh, I don't want to make candles. <laughs> um, she's like, I'm too tired. I can't. Yeah. You know, so I was like, Well, teach me how to do it. She's like, Well, I'll teach you. So we started doing it. And, I put like 20, 30 candles on, they sold like the first day or two. I believe it. And then ever since then, we've been doing candles about two years. What are these? Wax cones. What's that? Premium wax smell. So like, I don't know how these are. Except and you just melt them in one of the, like, the yeah, trays? Mm-hmm. Yeah, like your Scentsy Runners. Yeah. But uh, those are the premium melts, and they have a little bit more fragrance in them, so they're a lot stronger. <laughs> um, something that we added new are those little bottles in the back over there. Ooh. Um, those are actually burning oils. Oh, those are the burning oils? Yeah. Oh. So, so How much do those go for? Those are, so basically we have a sale going today and this week all the way to 420. Everything in the store is $9. Um, oh two, my gosh. Two, two of these for nine. Two for nine. Um, those are nine. 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 Every candle is nine. Nine. We spray so cloud nine. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I like that. Okay, all of the uh, new sprays and mm-hmm. lotions and all that. That's something new this year, right? Just uh, released the sprays last week. Um, okay. So the sprays have been something that surprises. Um, I saw that like. I saw that. Two days. So I, I just restocked. Uh, we have the cloud candy, cloud guava, um, cloud energy. Whoa. Strawberry mint and then eucalyptus mint. So, um, all so of the sprays were only nine bucks. Mm-hmm. Sprays are yeah, nine bucks. 
So they're good for uh, air freshener for like your car. Right. Um, something that's really unique that I use them for is like before you get in the shower, you turn the shower on real hot and you spray them in like the eucalyptus mint. Oh, yeah. And then you take a shower, it's real relaxing. Oh, yeah. It's real, yeah, real that's relaxing. Super nice. So, yeah, we make everything here. So. But you're also um, wholesaling, is that right? Are you wholesaling mm -hmm. to other states and other stores? So we ship to 23 states and three countries right now. So, um, one of the things that we do, I mean, I think the, the bigger part of the business is that we, uh, we create lines for people. So, if someone wants to make their own soap, if someone wants to make their own candle, we actually make it for them and then we create the labels for them and stuff like that too. And we, That's cool. You know, we put a little bitty cloud nine logo on the back, but <laughs> other yeah. than that, we create that, you know, so. Whatever their store images or absolutely. whatever. Absolutely. So That's uh, cool. So we help with like brand building and stuff like that. Yeah. And, that, and that, this is the way that we've been able to help people with building their brands. It's right. Candles, sprays, lip balms, soaps, um, lotions. All you name them. it. Whatever you can put your name on, we, we pretty much make it. Wow. Um, okay. 23 countries? Or 23 states? 23 states and 3 oh, countries. So, oh, I mean, it's a lot of shipping going on. You're doing a lot of shipping and a lot of candle making and a lot of lotions and oh I man. I never thought I would be doing... Making candles. Making candles. Yeah. <laughs> it, wasn't, it wasn't something that I planned to do. It wasn't yeah. something that I thought I would be doing. Right. But, uh, it's, it's actually fun. I like right? it. I, I bet. love it. I mean, some days I say, I mean, it's real relaxing. So. Right. And that's a good thing. Yeah. So, like, the, we started with the glass, and in the beginning, it was all water pipes and stuff I like know, that. I know, yeah. And the candles kind of just took over the front. Right. So well, they we, were selling like crazy. Yeah, they, they, the glass sold pretty well, but mm -hmm. the candles sell like crazy. Crazy. Sure. I never knew women like candles like that. So. <laughs> you have no you idea. You should have known. Yeah. Now you know. You should have <laughs> already known. Yeah. We yeah. love them in every room. So what's the future look at like here? What's going on over here? Um, In the back we have a, so basically when we started this we wanted to make it like a micro mall. Um, yeah. And each room will be a different business. So in this room we have Love and Coke. Then we have uh, Cloud line, vapor smoke through the hallway. And then eventually we'll have the smoothies and the fruit juices and stuff right here in the front. And then we have a store in the back that makes like accents and wall and like stuff for your walls and the home decor. Um it's called the gallery wall. Uh, a good a good friend of mine and his wife started the company about two, three months ago. So they're they're just building a lot of stuff and they do a lot of restoration. I saw some of that. Yeah, it's so gorgeous. A lot of stuff is, I mean, the stuff that they got is amazing. Like, they got a lot of 1908 type stuff. Really? 18, it's cool. 1872 type. Wow. So a lot of you, antiques that they brought back to life, you know, so. And I feel like it fit with, fit with the store really good. Right. So. Heck yeah. Yeah. So. Oh, that's awesome. Some of the smoothies, are you going to be making those or? Everything. Everything. Um, the goal with the smoothies is to use things that are really hard to find here. I know. Not only will we have smoothies, we'll have like um, old fashioned pops That's so from cool. 1884 to 1932. Yeah, look at that. 1924 Nesbits. Nesbits. What's a Nesbit? Nesbits of, Nesbits. Nesbits of California. They're really popular in California. I'm um, from Cali. What's a Nesbit? Nesbits. It's called Nesbits of California. Really? It's a pop. It, I mean, what year is it? Like oh, 19... 1924 is like Nesbitt's. 1924. That might be, I've never heard of it. Pete's Pop. <laughs> I mean, they're still, they still sell them there. Pete's Pop. Uh, oh, wait. 1917 Cherry... Cherry Is that Cherry, cherry wine? wine? Cherry Wine. Cherry mm -hmm. Wine. Oh, the wow. The oldest one is Moxie. Yeah. It's disgusting. We it is, really it is disgusting. <laughs> it, it like, I mean, it comes like wonderful. clove. Oh, wow. Like a clove. Like, oh, like a spicy clove. clove. It's like... Really, a spicy clove? It's like the first cola experiment ever made. Yeah, it's like the first Coca Cola. Oh, like, like Coca Cola probably like stole their recipe and just made it better. <laughs> like took the clove out and put. Okay. <laughs> this is hilarious. Okay, so the. Yeah. The cherry one is like the first cherry Pepsi. Okay, well that's that's doable. So, so all the pops, like you remember the movie, uh, The Big Lebowski? Yeah. yeah. Um, when he sits down and he's like, uh, let me get your best sarsaparilla. Mm -hmm. So that's the Sioux City uh, sarsaparilla. Sweet. Oh, okay. So 
that was like your first forms of like a root beer. Root beer. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and so, that yeah. cream soda. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah. So just like the candles, we infuse like Damiana leaf, peppermint, thyme, lemon balm, sage, valerian, catnip leaf into the candles, the soaps, all that. Like, so one of the neat things about the story is that any of the soaps, any of the waxes, any of the sprays, you can custom make yourself. So if you have a spray that you like, uh -huh. um, I have a lady that comes in at the beginning of every month and she buys like 30 different candles, wow. but she orders them, you know, yes. the exact same one, yeah. Oh, okay. So she just spreads them through her house and she burns them all month. And then we have women that come spend five, six, seven hundred dollars yeah. a month just on oh, okay. custom making candles. So one month they might want peach, pear, and right. like this month they want Ash and flower and valerian infused right. candles with just essential oils. So we can. Well, why would you make a catnip ca candle? I mean, just I'm, to, I'm just know, curious. Like, like is it? Listen, is it for cats? People with cats? Well, catnip is uh, when it comes to aromatherapy is also it's good for relaxation. For humans, really? Well, it's good for relaxation for everybody, and then you know they said they make the cats. Okay. Well, I was gonna say because it's not relaxing for cats. <laughs> no, they <laughs> bounce, say it drives bounce, them bounce. crazy. Yeah, right. right. They act but, crazy. Yeah, yeah they do get. But a for kid. humans, they say if you va even if you vape it, what is that? A hundred degrees. That's oh, you can vape that too. Yeah. So all those. Well, it's for vape. indigestion. There's a lot of different. Really. That's cool. Wow. Sweet. Okay. Now, when we come back, though, okay, so we've gotten through some of the different lines and some of the different products. Mm -hmm. I do want to get a couple pictures of that that decor. Oh my God. Yeah, the back room. Can we do that? Um. There's not here. Pictures. They're not here yet. They're not but so there's just a couple pieces back there that I already fell in love with. Well, we'll do that next time. Okay, we'll, we'll do that then. When, when okay. they get it, when they get it ready, I don't know okay. if he's ready to show yet. So. Oh, okay. Okay, but man, there's some nice pieces. Okay, so where are we? Where can people find you? Tell me everything. Okay, so we're located in Riverside. Um, it's 824 West 13th, and it's on the corner of 13th and Woodland. Okay, and phone number? 316-519-8735. Um, you can add me on Facebook at Adrian Love, or on Instagram or Twitter at B-U-B-L-O-V-E, -E. Snapchat B-U-B-L-O-V-E. -E. So, yeah, um, we also have a 420 show at Rock Island. Yeah, tell me about that. 420. Um, uh, artist named Staley, he he signed to Maybach Music with uh, Rick Ross and uh, really yeah, so it'll be a nice show. Every year we do a 420 show, so this is the Up and Smoke tour. So right on. So yeah. and people can get tickets here for that. They can get tickets here and they're ten dollars a piece, and then at the door they might be like twenty bucks. So whoa, they should really rush, rush in and get, them. get yeah. tickets here. Now this is you've been doing. A Several shows already this year. Oh man, a lot. That's what I thought. We I'm do like, every, I mean, we did Boosie. We've done. I mean, we've done a lot of shows. I can't even begin to list them all because we've done. These walls are normally fit, right. full of posters and stuff like that. And summertime's coming, so it'll get back busy. Right. With the show. A lot more. Be a lot more shows. I mean, but. And you do indoor, that. outdoor, or what? Um, we don't do a little bit of everything. You know, cool. that's me. I I, I want to do everything. You do, right? He do never stops. He just never stops. So we got a store opening in Portland. Um, oh, that's where it's Oregon? opening. Oh, absolutely. Really? Portland, I always say Seattle somehow. I don't know why I just yeah. this so in. close. It's right? all far away. It's yeah. all up there with beautiful yeah. mountains and, yeah. and ocean breezes. So Portland, and that, that store's inside of the dispensary. Oh, it is? Yeah. See? So, I, I knew that you were getting some going on so that. So all the Love & Co. stuff will be in there. Wow. Um, I'll have, have to check it out and get ready to go see my daughter here not too long. Yeah. We'll be going over there. There you Come go. See us. I'm gonna, it, it'll be Cloud 9 Pacific Northwest. Um, That's cool. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. See how you try to keep doing it all? <laughs> and then we have another store um, up in Omaha. Really? Yeah, so. Now that one I know is not in a dispensary. No. <laughs> <laughs> and that one has no pipes. Oh, okay. One in Omaha is just Love and Co. It won't be a cloud nine. It'll just be all candles. Love and Co. Love yeah, we're not going to play in that. But I don't, I don't know how Nebraska is with the pipes and stuff. I don't think they're very they're friendly. They're not, yet. no, they're not they're, friendly. Yeah, they're kind of like, yeah, Kansas uh, or Oklahoma. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, not but about it. Oregon, anymore. we're going to have fun. Yeah, yeah. We're going to have a lot, a lot of fun. So I can't wait for that. That's one of the things well, I've been waiting on. I'll have to come see you in Oregon, huh? Yeah, I'm 
trying to get to Denver with you guys. Oh, I yeah. know, come to Denver with come me. Out. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, come to Denver. With That's the, a lot with closer. The, store, um, the thing that I've been waiting to do this year is uh, we're about to do another remodel. Um, okay. And the lines will have a soap, a spray, a candle, um, an incense, all of each scent. Oh, whoa. So we're trying to get back to 50 some cents at all times. That's time. awesome. Yeah, we, we normally do releases where we drop about six to eight candles uh -huh. every month and a half. Right. This time we're gonna go with probably like 50 cents. So we're trying to fill up this entire place with different candles and different scents and sprays wow. and such. So right now, like, my garage is turned into a, a manufacturing candle place. factory. Yeah. yeah. So people don't understand, really, it is it is relaxing, but it's also very time consuming. Right, y'all did candles, y'all did. We've so done them. Know. We know, know, honey, yeah. we know. I'm patting you, because it is a lot of work, but it is. It is relaxing. Everybody always tells me, you make candles, it can't be too much. I'm like, man. You have no clue. Labels, yeah. cleaning, pouring, mixing, temperature. Wax in itself. Cooling. Yeah. Uh, the wax is messy. Right. Yeah. Messy. Yeah. I mean, it's like, you wax know, gets I, I can't even I don't. I don't buy clothes anymore. <laughs> right? <laughs> Every piece of clothing I get. Got some wax. Got some wax. Yeah. Somehow I get an order or something. Like, I'm here. I get yeah, bring that out. Oh, this yeah. Is. Yeah, I saw this. You guys have to see this. This cracks me up. Um, I can tell when you have a really talented, fantastic candle maker in the building because this is what it's going to look like. Your heating elements yeah. look like that. Like, this is terrible, though. But, yeah, they just get. I mean, mm. I've had this one for three years, and we don't yeah. use it anymore. It's, yeah. This one's retired, so we just kind of left it how it was. But this can this has made over six thousand candles. Yep, I believe it. Wow. By itself, this one. I believe and it. And we got a couple other ones now that we use, but thanks, honey. That just goes to show you, though, it is messy. It is. Yeah, it is. I and mean, it is a lot of work too. Yeah, messy. Yeah, no oh, matter yeah. what you do, no matter how careful you are. Yeah. You know, the funny thing is that now that the candles, I mean, it seems like I'm a lot. It's a lot neater at home because I know I can't mess up the house. Right? <laughs> and so it's like I'm getting it on single core right. every time. Sweet. Here it's like yeah. messy air stuff on the wall. But, but not at home. Not Gotta at be home. a little more careful at home. Gotta be careful. Enough. We're gonna take a quick break. We're gonna come back and uh, I think we're gonna have a phone call for some friends. Um, call about maybe. We don't know for sure. Yeah, we'll find out. We'll find out. Okay, we'll be right back. Real People, Real Life, Wichita, Kansas, America! America! America. America. <laughs> 